Welcome to Sayuslaw National Forest. And you too, Lassie. How's everything, Jack? Oh, it was all there when I checked it out this morning. The woods, the lakes, the sand dunes, the ocean. You got a lot of work lined up? Enough to keep you busy. More recreational areas, huh? Uh, plenty of them. And you can help us decide where to put them. And there's another little problem, Bob, uh, out on the sand dunes. But uh, let's take one at a time, huh? I take it we begin right here. Right now. This lake has been a flyway for thousands of years. That ought to give the birds some sort of a priority. And I'm sure they wouldn't appreciate water skiers zooming around. Now, if the birds only use this lake as a stopover during their migration, we could open it up for boating and water skiing after they've headed north. You don't think the birds would mind sharing the lake with us humans? <laughs> They'll never know. <laughs> People send over the records on this lake. Good. Where to next? I have a dozen other places I want to show you along the highway. Some have good possibilities for development, and some are questionable. Well, judging from the statistics I've seen, you need every bit of recreational area you can find room for. They tell me last year you had 17 and a half million people roaming these woods. I've got news for you, Bob. We expect a 12% increase this year, another next year, and another the year after that. <whistles> Let's get going. I'll get Lassie.
Go on, Lassie. It's a nice place for a campground. Plenty of shelter, room for parking, and adequate water. Yes, and there's a special attraction here you don't see at first. Oh, what's that? These sheltered valleys slope down to the ocean, which means there's plenty of rain and fog. A rainforest? Mm-hmm. You don't notice the change until you've walked back into the woods. It's quite a sight, Bob. Perfect for a nature trail, huh? Mm-hmm. Let's have lunch. Fine. Hang on to this, Bob. Sure thing. Well, what do you have? Cheese, cheese, or cheese? I think I'll take cheese. <laughs> it appears my wife is pushing one of our local industries. Well, I'm here to learn as much as possible about Oregon. You hungry, Lassie? I don't think so. Bob! It may not be a bad idea for you to have this map. Spend a couple of days tramping around by yourself until you get familiar with these places. Well, that'll help. I'd like to see them in different times of day, different weather, until I really know what the vacation is letting himself in for.
Hi. You need help? Oh, no thanks, Ranger. I'm just taking advantage of the beautiful country you got here to do a little work on the car. Well, what's your trouble? Oh, no trouble. I just changed the oil. I've been pushing her pretty hard lately. <laughs> time we were both heading back home. Oh, where's home? Jacksonville, Florida. Uh -huh. Where have you been? Oh, yeah? Well, we've got a lot of territory to cover. Come on. Good luck. Thanks. I'll be back here one of these days. Well, next time you do, you'll probably find a campground here. Hey, that's a great idea. <laughs> so long. Pretty dog. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Ha 
Watch out. Let's find out. over his feathers, made him helpless. Hey, that must have come from my engine. I, uh, I threw the old crankcase oil into the stream. Well, it wasn't deliberate. It never is. If I had a nickel for every time someone carelessly tosses on the ground or into the stream, something that looks innocent but is really deadly. You could retire a rich man? Look, I'll get something and clean him up. Fine. Sure wouldn't want to have that little fellow on my conscience. Well, you had no way of knowing. Neither would anyone else. That'll change a lot of plans. What do you mean? There are plenty of other places along this coast for campgrounds, but not in that clearing or in this stream. Within a year, this pond would be filled with cans and bottles and kinds of junk you couldn't possibly imagine. Like uh, oil? Yeah, like oil. Our first responsibility is to protect these ducks. Well, you mean you wouldn't put in a campground here just because of one duck and a duckling? My friend, there are a couple of hundred eyes watching your every movement. Mm -hmm. 